flooding rain, a car off the road in seconds to save the man inside in Garza County. And it is good to see you again. I'm Brian Mudd. And I'm Lauren Motter. That 19-year-old airman from Cannon Air Force Base rescued from the car this morning, all happening south of Post. Yeah, two brave volunteer firefighters got him out of there and came back. Juliana Washburn's here to take us through what happened. Well, Brian and Lauren, Garza County Sheriff Terry Morgan tells us the call came in just before 7. A car went off Highway 84 and was in a riverbed with quickly rising waters. That's when two firefighters and fire chief from Post stepped in. A picture that tells a whole story. Um, I'm the one in the black shirt. Setson's kind of going underwater. Yeah, right there. Two volunteer firefighters pulling a man out of the water on Highway 84. And that's when everything started going through your mind of how it was going to play and, you know, and make sure we got back to safety. Stetson Simmental and Sebastian Chapa using a harness and ropes. Just take it one step at a time. Their chief on the other end. You're, you're seconds now. Seconds counts. So. It was a first for Simmental and Choppa. It was pretty nerve wracking and scary, but uh, I knew I had a great grip, group of men behind me and uh, knew I never had doubted them, not once. When they pulled the man out. Relieved that we got him out safe. Yeah. Got to see him live another day. Garza County Sheriff. Thank you. Bye. Proud of the two firefighters. None of them are paid. So it's, it's an all-volunteer department. I just am extremely grateful for what they've done. And glad they got there in time. They were out there in no time. Uh, the, the water was rising about a foot, about a foot and a half from the time we got there till the time the fire department got there. Look, we're far from heroes. We're just called upon and we do the job that we need to do and serve our community. Sheriff Morgan said the man in the car was not injured and is safe now.